welcome again to my crypto channel. I just found out a great way to save money on gas fees when you make transactions on the Binance Smart Chain. I got this tip from the Drip Nomad YouTube channel, so a big shout out to Drip Nomad for sharing this with the community. If you make a lot of network transactions, you probably also hate paying gas fees all the time. But here's an easy way to pay less fees. You will need to set up a new Binance Smart Chain network in your MetaMask wallet, but don't worry. It's easy and I will guide you through the process. Open your MetaMask wallet first, click on the network at the top, and then click on the Add Network button. MetaMask will expand in full mode in your browser window. Now we need to add a network manually. Use a different network name, like Binance New Chain, or anything else that you prefer. When done, put in the following link in the new RPC URL field. https colon slash slash rpc dot anchor dot com slash bsc. I will leave the network name in the description below, so you can copy and paste the info. The chain ID for this network is 56, and the currency symbol is BNB. In the block explorer field you just put in https colon slash slash bsc scan dot com. Save the network, and you're done. We can now test the new address and find out if it works. Let's do a hydrate in drip. Connect to the website, click on hydrate and wait until the MetaMask window pops up. You can see that the current gas fee for this transaction will cost me 80 cents. To change that and make it lower, click the edit link and then select the edit suggested gas fee button. Change the gas price in the form field to 1, and save the window. Let's take a look at the new gas fee now. The gas fee dropped from 80 cents to only 16 cents. This is incredible. Now let's see if it really works. Let me confirm the transaction in my Ledger hardware wallet, and give it a few seconds to complete. I need to open my Ledger device first and click a few buttons to allow the transaction. And here we go. The transaction went through just fine, and I saved 64 cents on this single gas fee. If it shouldn't work for any reason, you can adjust the number in the suggested gas price settings to 2 or 3, and see what happens. The higher the numbers, the more gas fees you pay. But I did not get any error messages so far, so I will keep using the same gas fee settings. Let me know if this tip also worked for you in the comments below, and feel free to share this video with other people who may also like saving on their gas fees. They will love you even more if you tell them how to do it. If you found some value in this video, please hit the like and subscribe button, and don't forget to smash the notification bell to be the first to find out when I post a new video. Have a great day, and stay safe.